Okay, so we had to pull the bumper stops out and they get wedged in, so you've got to be fairly firm. Then you put them back to the bumper bar and then knock them all the way into the hole. All right, here we go. Yeah. Like this. Block of wood on the back of it because we don't have a brass mallet. Let's get that one started. Nah, it needs more lube. Alright, she's dry. She's dry. She's dry. She's dry. Oh no! We've got action! It's going in! Oh, look at that! Look, I bought one! Look, I bought one! Hey, Ralph. Not her own, Ralphie. Oh! That broke it. That did, I think. And then you just pull it home, do you? Pull it home, fold up the top yeah. there. So you just do a bolt in the top here. Can we get pull it, it any home. further? And away we go. We're just dropping the motor in at the moment. Yeah. Loose chain, loose engine. And we'll come back when we're going to tighten the chain. Just in the process of tighten, tightening the chain at the moment. I take stuff there. About 20 mil, 25 mil of clay. She's about right. Okay, it is now Thursday night once again, a week later. And as you can see, the cart is now blue. And we've put the controller in. We have now mounted the guard. It is fantastic. No one can get their fingers caught in chains. And it is good. If anyone's stupid enough to try and reach past the tyre to get there, God help them. But if anyone, as they're getting out the cart, accidentally puts a hand there, they're not going to get hurt or anything like that. Or if they're standing next to the cart, they're not going to get hurt. Now, the most important thing is that we've mounted the plate here. This is almost ready to go. Battery box is in. Uh, front battery box will be in soon. Friday, the 18th of December, will be D-Day. Tomorrow, we will get this go-kart going. It will move, or I will pull my hair out. Okay, what else? Now, as you can see, the room's a mess, but we have our batteries, and our batteries have been bound down, and as you can see, the terminals are now in, and we now have our leads, and we've insulated our leads to make sure that the tips don't short out and don't present a fire hazard. We also have the second box being done now. That will be completed soon. Um, once those two boxes go in, We'll be using the battery charger, which is that device there, to charge the batteries up. And then we are going to go for a ride. Anyway, see you All later. right, it's now Friday morning on the 19th, and it's now quarter to 11. We are, I would estimate, T minus three hours, maybe four, from moving this superb piece of engineering down the road. So, we got Maddie. Say hi, Maddie. Hey, hey. Maddie has put all the side pods on and put the front bumper on. And look how gorgeous it looks. Trust me, once it's in the sunlight, you guys are going to go, oh my gosh, that is fantastic. Because it really is. Um, so, we've got to now put the seat on, put the batteries in, wire them up, and we're good to go. Okay, so... We've put some black foam mat, some three mil black foam mat from uh, Clark Rubber and we've put it in the bottom of the tray and just wedge it home and it's going to support the battery nice and neat. You see here and the corners of the battery should wedge in there quite nicely and uh, stop it from sliding out. So yeah, once it's in I'm going to pack it around with foam and then put a couple of bolts in to clamp it but uh, we'll take it for a dress test drive before then, just to see how she rock and rolls. But she's almost there. Now the battery trays are in and mounted properly. Um, accelerator's nearly done now. Um, redone properly. And we're nearly good to go. There we go. Sweet. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
just working on fitting the Anderson connectors and working out where everything's going to be wired. That's it. You just push, once you sold the Anderson connector in, you just push it till it clicks. That's will. If you force it hard enough, well, right. wrong way around. If you push it and it clicks. There we go. Just click in. Like that. So. Good enough slack. Okay, we're back. It's Monday morning of the 21st of December 09. School finished three days ago, yet the go-kart goes on, so we are still here. But we have got everything just about plumbed in. We do have some ugly little bits of wire flying around. That's because some of the lengths were pre-cut and uh, pre-terminated so nothing we can do about that they're too difficult to cut and re-terminate uh, we can tidy them up next year we've got the student coming back who had the tool for that but this year go-kart El Nelly Dunnes is uh, on its way we just mounted the stop button stop button woohoo that's in so rock and roll there we now are going to finish off the series link it's going to link one battery to the next so that's the one series link positive to negative and uh, then we're finishing off the lead going to the mop to the controller and the final lead going to the controller and uh, then it's just a matter of hooking up the um, the stop switch through seriesing through the um, the little micro switch on the pedal and into the controller and then hooking up the box to the controller and job's right so yeah we'll be back when we've put the series in hey hey Galbo <laughs> so we just mount the seat now and um, we've got to put these wedges in and they form a wedge shape and we'll put them in beside the seat what holes we go for hmm? what holes we go for oh, one two one second yeah we've put that out there oh because we're temporarily mounting the sides yeah right, cool Yep. Uh, the front one. Oh, oh, the so and then the reds go between it. Yeah, the reds go in between the frame and the All right, you get your side in. Yep. All right. Oh. Hold on a second. So it's easy just to put them on like that. And then line it up. And we go like that's it. Then turn the right around. Face the right direction. Hold a second. The one's not quite facing the right direction. Alright, so we're all wired up. Batteries are in. Everything's ready. Oh, first test. Alright, block of wood underneath the back, guys. So, alright, and if it goes backwards, we know we need to swap the motor around. Okay, so. All right, do you want to push the accelerator, Jim? Oh, I'll do it. I'll do it. Here, you videotape. All right. Who wants to push it like that? Let's see if it will. Look at it go. Uh, it's awesome. Look out. Why? There's a push button in the middle. Ah. Oh. Oh, what will happen? Something shorted. I think that was a fuse. Was it? Sure. I hope it was a fuse. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 